Good morning. It's the Good Morning Podcast. I'm Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on Twitter. Sorgatron.com. All the places. Please subscribe. YouTube and uh, the iTunes and everything else. Good morning with Michael Sorg. That's me. Um, today, we're going to workshop some stuff, guys. I'm very excited about some stuff um, and, and wanted to play a little bit. And I've had this uh, some more ideas on the back of my head, as I always do. As I always do. Um, you know, I, I've been really uh, excited about, uh, you know, not not grand, oh my God, numbers. But, you know, the numbers I've seen for this show, doing something short, daily uh, kind of thing, kind of... Uh, uh, it's kind of like my morning open mic, actually, uh, doing something for for ten minutes every day. Um, but but I, I want to play a little bit more. Um, before I get to that, though, one other thing I've been excited about. Let's talk. I mean, we're generally going to talk about video today. Um, one thing I've been experimenting with, and this is uh, this is all Gary Vaynerchuk's fault. Um, I've been playing with uh, the the video on Instagram, putting short clips, like for instance, of the Mayhem show on on instagram uh starting an instagram for it for, in, in the first place and and, and kind of dealing with that um and I, it's been really interesting right off the bat we really had a lot of people jump on it um you know uh, partly i think I, I i actually invited everybody in my feed from facebook but other than that um but no we we, we got a lot a lot from there we see a lot of interaction First of all, from people that are not people I know, I, that's a you know it's one thing to get you know people I know, people that are in the fold to uh, to like things. I get the same maybe ten people uh, liking photos on my personal account all the time, um, but in this case we do have a lot more. We're playing more with hashtags. It's reaching out a little bit, and the nice thing is we can feature things like last week we have Facade, great local wrestler, uh, guy I've known guy I've known before he started hitting the ring. Um, it's really great to see him doing awesome. We got to put that video up and put a little clip of that, him talking about working with Sabu a couple weeks ago. So sorry for a little bit of blood there on, on, on the video, but it is Sabu, if you know what he does. But um, I, I think they've been really responsive. You know, it's something that he can jump on there. It's been really cool to see what IWC Wrestling has been doing on Instagram as well. More photography, but then again, they got the great Daniel Hooven behind that doing some tremendous, tremendous stuff. Um, and they've been doing really awesome too. And that's really cool to see. Um, but playing with this idea of the short video, originally, as you know, Instagram takes 15 second videos and, uh, you know, and then that's the limit. So when we're doing hour, hour and a half shows here on Tuesday night for podcast day, um, you know, it's kind of hard and I have to go through and pick a clip and, 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 and do that kind of thing. Um, I've been really inspired by, there's a, uh, Amber Mac on Instagram, Amber uh, MacArthur, she used to do, oh, geez, she was on Call for Help, I think, for a time, at least the Canadian version, and uh, and she's done a bunch of other stuff uh, 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 this week in uh, well, Net at Night, whatever that became. Um, so, so it starts kind of poking at that, poking at some of these shorter form ideas, and, uh, and even... You know, and where can we put these things? And another thing I started experimenting with this week, and I kind of had a revelation of, uh, you know, putting things directly on Facebook. I took last night's uh, May, uh, raw wrap up that we did, uh, Mad Mike and myself on Google Plus, and went ahead and put that straight on there, and see what happens. You know, um, you know, see see how many plays we do get. And I'm kind of trying to figure out how does this play into when I do my my worksheets for for stats at the end of the day and it's uh, fairly straightforward i got the video page now this is a recent addition to facebook um and i can see exactly what people have checked out and i can see um there's been a few views on on the clips i've been putting because i've been taking the instagram 15 second clips and throwing them up there as, as just a quick thing and, and i like that you know you you do have um the autoplay function so i think that helps for for exposure a little bit as it, as it passes on somebody's feed. I know eventually, you know, to get these out there, you're going to have to hit the promote button and pay for it because it's Facebook after all. But if it becomes something shareable, maybe you'll get lucky, especially with some of these interviews and stuff uh, that we do. We got some uh, pretty decent names we've had since the beginning of the year, and uh, it looks like that train isn't stopping. Um, like a lot of current TNA, former WWE guys um, are, are on the list for this year. So, I'm really, I'm really excited about that and see how that kind of uh, picks up activity on on the uh, decidedly dormant Facebook page. Um, you know, all the interaction is happening over on the group for Wrestling Mayhem Show, but also I want to liven up um, the YouTube channels a, a bit too. 
So the big thing I want to do is, uh, much like I'm already in a workflow, doing this every morning, well, four mornings a week, it's just the way my schedule is, and this other idea is going to be four mornings a week, um, but we're looking at uh, doing, and I'm going to pilot the first couple uh, today, um, maybe one, maybe two, is doing a, sort of a minute show. Um, do a, <laughs> my ideas in my head. Mayhem Minute is going to be one of them. Uh, Tech Sec for Awesome Cast is, is the other one. And, and going to try to really aim those for, for uh, 60 seconds. Um, I wish I could do something quick that I could put on Instagram. But I could put more of it on Instagram. If, I, if I'm compacting that info into 60 seconds, 15 seconds is probably going to be a little more valuable when I do put it on Instagram. Um, I think... Twitter, of course, is, is kind of slow rolling out its video component, and I'm very interested to get, jump on board with that. Uh, Vine, I don't think I can get some stuff on Vine. I, I, I just feel like six seconds is just going to kill any of these, and it's just going to take a little bit more than, than I'm able to to make it make sense on a six-second platform. Or I can just put it up there. You know, you can always just put it out and see, see what happens, you know? Put a sentence, as somebody says. Something like that, you know? I, I could take the most ridiculous thing that happens on the Mayhem show every... I'm, I'm, I'm workshopping, man. I'm workshopping. Always, always pound those ideas out. It's what I love about what's going on right now with video and social media is there's a lot of things to try. Um, and, and, and the bad thing is you have no idea what's going to work. And uh, I, I've been searching for the thing that's going to work for, for a few years now uh, as far as uh, this, this, this independent production kind of thing. And also, like, I have this down here I, I, it's not you know i, I kind of joked uh with uh, ron kraus on awesome cast this week i was like well you got to see my 50 dollars studio just visited recently the uh the twist studios as we mentioned at the beginning of the year and uh and their million dollar podcast studio i i like to say i have a 50 dollar podcast studio um i hope it doesn't sound like 50 dollars uh hopefully at least 150 uh but uh it's it's uh it's something i want to utilize a bit more and it, again you know if it's something that i just flip a switch turn this light on and these these things are already rolling i boot up wirecast and we go it's uh it's kind of opening up possibilities for me uh for just like a quick workflow um, and, uh, I'm trying to do the same thing with the green screen. I, I, I've played with the idea of doing these short bits as green screen, but the setup's just not there. Um, I don't have a camera I can dedicate to that portion of the studio yet. Um, as it is like, as it is a sitting over there from last Thursday shoot. And I still have to set it up for, uh, what should be shooting today for journal of lifestyle, lifestyle medicine. Um, plus we have other stuff we're workshopping. This is my, I don't know. It's because I don't know. It's because I watched to be put decay, decay, decay. I learned that part. Um, but the workshop is kind of my word of, of the moment. Um, and you'd understand if you would watch that movie, uh, the play they're working with. But um, but always got to be pushing new ideas, too, um, and, and where they fit in, and, and hopefully uh, new ideas that don't, you know, supersede the good ideas um, or the money-making ideas. You know, I still have to pay the bills here, you know, with something. And I do have some jobs here that are that are working out pretty well but uh but hopefully one day this will be it and this will be what i do all day <laughs> that's the goal right that's the goal um anyways in the meantime i'll be here in my 50 dollars studio um let me know what you think if you got any other and i'd love to do this um and, and again it's just kind of time and effort um um trying to figure that out but like if this really works i i, I feel like it's something like i remember um guys uh, uh other podcasts they would just do a mini cast for the rest of the week and and how that significantly helped their podcast numbers and that's the other thing if i do these um um video shorts do i stick the audio in with the main feeds for awesome cast and wrestling mayhem show something i'm battling with right now and i think i'm going to put a poll up for the mayhem show group um you know is that fair that people subscribe to that or should i just dictate that and just make it happen if it's going to help the numbers i mean it's a minute thing I, it can't be too bad right um in the meantime We'll figure it out. We're going to be working with that, uh, workshopping that a bit. Hey, workshop, yeah. Uh, <laughs> so much great stuff going on here in Pittsburgh. But I'll, I'll, I'll speak to some of those here, well, in the tech sec, for one thing, um, and a few other places. So until next time, have a good morning. Please let us know. Oh, question. Um, what, uh, what, what content would you like to see in a, in a minute package every day? Like, uh, do you have any ideas for angles? What do you want to see from Awesome Cast? What do you want to see from Wrestling Mayhem Show? I know some of you guys listening out there are fans of of one or the other. Um, like, what should we target? 
uh, for, for that kind of stuff. Um, the idea right now is uh, I find the awesome story from the last 24 hours. I find the latest wrestling story that I have an opinion on, and we hit it. You know, it's just a mini mayhem. It's a mini awesome cast. Um, and uh, just a quick thing that, that hopefully uh, flourishes on uh, YouTube, amongst other things. And, and hopefully people enjoy that as well. So with that, have a good morning, guys. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.